Goodbye, downtown LA loft slash studio. Goodbye bathroom. Goodbye bathroom closet, where I put my fishing stuff. Goodbye in-unit washer dryer, still finishing up a, some laundry there. Goodbye shower. And goodbye view. This is my favorite part about living here. But it was also a tough time living here with the protests and riots. So this is supposed to be a fun celebration, but look at this. minutes ago look at this right now okay this entire block has been taken over by crazy fans look at this madness I will not miss all the madness that happens down there. Peace out. It's 5, 5 a.m. in the morning and I'm walking into the new set. Let's see how this looks. Well, I definitely got some work to do to hook everything back up, but this is looking pretty dope. What's up, guys? Well, first of all, welcome to my new apartment. I'll probably take you on a tour some other day, but I thought for today I'd show you a little bit of another day in the life. I already had my coffee, but right now it's 8.56 a.m., and I'm doing a sponsor call. It's called an onboarding call with a sponsor. So whenever we have a sponsor for the show, oops, whenever we have a sponsor for the show, they always want to talk to someone on the show. Usually they want to talk to the hosts, but since I'm both a producer and a on-air personality, I do all the calls for our shows. Let's see if I can show you a little bit of this call. Welcome to Google Meet. Enter the meeting pin followed by the pound key. I hate this part. Thank you. You have joined the call, but you are the only one here. Typical, typical. You have joined the call, but you are the only one here. As per usual. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? This is Chin with Below the Belt. Awesome. Good about what you're doing. You're different, and then, uh, and then leave it up to any questions you might have. In COVID, obviously, things have changed a little bit, but also outside of COVID, um, you know, whether, someone, whether you like to cook, whether you don't like to cook, any questions? No, I, the, the deaths look super thorough, so not many questions, but one, I guess one question. Have you guys done this with other podcasts already previously? We've been, we've been advertising on, on some other podcasts as well. Great. Have you noticed anything in particular that worked the best for the reads? Yeah, so thanks, so wait, yeah sure. I think that, so really the key for us that we've seen in the past. Awesome. Well, thanks so much for your time. If you have any other questions, uh, feel free to reach out. Appreciate it, guys. Have yeah, a good one. All right. Thank you. You too. Thanks. Bye. -bye. You too. Thanks, Bye. Uh, bye. And that's what you do. Done with that. Now it is 9, a, nine something a.m. It only took like what, 
10 minutes for the call. Now to get ready to go to the studio. Today we have Jeremiah Watkins. And today will be the first day we use our, our brand new video switcher. So we'll have, I'm gonna have three cameras for today, a wide and then an A and a B. And it might get a little tricky. This is the first time we're doing it. So I don't know, you know, I don't know exactly how much I wanna switch back and forth and how, how much I wanna do the wide and all that stuff. So it's gonna be a feeling out process that takes, I'm sure a few shows. And then, yeah, I'll take you guys to the studio. Unless you wanna see me shower right now. All right, let's go to the shower. All right, guys, let's take a look at my lunch. And yep, shaved my head. All right, we got some of these toasted. I don't know if these are toasted crackers or whatever. These are really good, but they're very expensive. They're like $6.99 for a freaking, I don't know, for like a, what do you even call it? A tray of it. There's that. I have four Zevias in here, different flavors. This is black cherry. Great, my favorite. And then also this is ginger ale. My girlfriend made me these delicious deviled eggs. I had, I had three of them on Monday, and I'm gonna have three today. Today's Wednesday. My girlfriend also bought me some jazz and sliced it up. <gasps> Damn it! Jazz and Vietnamese pork loaf that I talked about before. And this is just hummus. All right, I'll put this stuff away and then see you guys either downstairs or at the studio. All new parking structure. My new city, Playa del Rey. Closer to the airport, I actually hear jets very often flying over, landing and stuff like that, but I'm getting used to it, so it's not too bad. And just right around there, walk all the way up that hill and go around, there's the beach. And that's where I plan on going fishing, surf fishing, very soon. Which reminds me, I gotta buy my annual fishing license, the freshwater and ocean one. And it's better to buy it early because it's by calendar year. So if you buy in January, you have all year. But if you buy it in December, same price, and you can only fish for the remainder of December. So I'll buy that later today, I think. All right, we're here. Here's a new set. Now let me turn everything on. Sony A7S III, we got two of them. HDMI for the switcher. There's a monitor for the switcher. Jukebox. Oh, don't do this afterwards. I don't trust the guys are gonna knock it over. All right, and there you can see the two angles there. Program feed is actually what the audience will see. That's what'll be on the TV showing. This is just a preview to see what's gonna happen. So to make sure that the cameras are okay here, since this is a third party AC adapter, just press okay. This is all my food. Okay, so here we go. It's two different angles. Of course, they're not like zoomed in or focused in yet. So once everyone gets in, I'll handle all that. And then now I need a camera for the middle, which will be my own GH5, Panasonic GH5. I have to clear the, the display. There's something called HDMI out, and then you'll see all this stuff. I don't know if you can see it. It'll be displayed onto the program feed unless you remove it from the camera itself. So I'll do that right now first. All right, so I set up Panasonic GH5 for the main wide Sony A7S III with a 24 to 70 millimeter Sigma lens for now that angle so this is going to be one that's going to be two and then this will be three so one two three it's getting a little warm my ssd drives you definitely don't want to do that okay 
Luckily, it's carpet here, so it didn't really fall that hard. So this is purely for audio. This 500 gigabyte one. I have all my sessions and my session templates, audio session and session templates on this. And I use this Samsung T7 one terabyte. It's a faster drive. And I use this for all my video editing. So Final Cut sessions and video files on this. Dark here, but so there's my HDMI. I'm happy that Panasonic and Sony, at least the Sony A7S III, they uh they all have a full size HDMI, which I prefer. So this is gonna go right into here. These are all HDMI 2.1 cables. Oh, you can see the ISO difference on camera three, right? So I'm gonna turn that up a little. So one, remember look at the program feed. One, two, three. Two, three. All right, let's go. Change the ISO on this guy. Boom, 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 boom. Here's another tricky part. This studio, we're waiting for some mic arms to come in. They're all gonna be table mic arms. So I have to somehow configure this to where we can get Jeremiah and um, Malik on this side with two mics and then one more mic over there. So it sucks because we only have the standing mic arms. I don't know, I'll figure something out. All right, Brennan just got here and dropped off. There's two in here, one over there. It's gonna be the table mic arms that I was talking about earlier. So once we get our full size table in here, I can go ahead and drill into the middle of the table, all four mics and extend them out this way. Let's get this set up. just temporary I have to get one of these extending arms so the XLR cable and the back end of it doesn't start bumping against this I don't know if this cable is gonna be long enough so I just have to daisy chain it with a different cable but for now let's do this daisy chain. input seven right there set at 53 I'll go between 53 and 55 on input double. Okay. Whew. Alec and Chappelle, they're at the gate, so they're gonna come in just a bit. I got some GoPro batteries charging here, here, there. Whew. Okay, notes. This is what I do in the morning. 641, Jera. Hawkins. My handwriting is terrible. I can do it really well, but I just don't, I'm so, like, I want to just get through it. I understand what I'm writing anyway, so who cares? What's up? Oh, you wore the beanies. Huh? What is, oh, you had the uh, beanie, beanie on. Beanie yeah, yeah, I wish oh, I had a beanie. Gotcha. I didn't, I didn't. This is how I usually have my hair on. I rarely grow it. Oh, we about to be crunched up in here. I like Wait, which yeah. Uh, yeah. So that's how we're going to figure out how you guys want to sit. How you want to do the let me try. I just need to go there. Okay. Let's go here. Ready to see. Let me button it. If you don't slide through, get your ass through the back. Like, crawl your ass through the back, dog. You see the album, Jeremiah? Yeah. You don't crawl your ass. Chin, I got one for you, too, bro. Thanks, dude. You cut your hair, too. Yeah. When'd you cut it? Uh, Wait, you cut your hair as well? No, Thanks, I didn't dude. cut my own hair. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on here? No, I don't trust God. Is this a sign y'all trying to tell me? No, no I'm waiting on my barber. <laughs> Whatever, mm -hmm. I brought CDs and vinyl, whichever y'all have. Whatever. We have a vinyl player somewhere. Oh, cool. I guess I'm on the outside, man. Cat's three minutes away. We'll just wait for Cat. Okay. Okay. Ooh, I'm so happy. Oh, when'd you get nice. this? Right? When'd you get the pizza? Right? Uh, I got it right when they opened at 12. Oh, you're going to do that one They're so nice. 
Have we tried this before? Uh, no, we have not. Oh, okay. Sweet. Honey, garlic. No, 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 no. All right. Four. Mm -hmm. I never eat six of those tacos. They're nice though, huh? You gonna sit there? All right. You just so you never had it. I admitted that. Oh, yeah. Yo, you stupid, dog. Because that's the real shit. That's the real shit. That's the real shit. Hey, girl, I saw you back. Yo, we'll let go. Hey, you know she pulled up. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it is now 827. Can you see it? 8.27 p.m. If you can't, you can see that big old clock over there. 8.27, 8.25 p.m. I am, I've already finished editing the entire show. Something happened, which really sucks. The, the switcher, for whatever reason, we have three cameras. And when I was switching, it looked perfectly fine on the, on the, uh, the monitor. And it looks kind of fine when you see the final program uh, feed of everything. But then there's sections of the video where it's kind of like, choppy so i can't use any of those cuts i had to do all the cuts my, myself manually in the end so it took me a long time today and i have to figure out what's going on with the machine and the settings so i set all the cameras to 4k 24 frames per second but i'm wondering if i should have put just 1080p 24 frames per second on each camera because that the 810 mini iso pro it also does the, the maximum it outputs is uh 1080p I want the cameras to be as clear and clean as possible, so I put them at 4K. I'm gonna try that. And also a guy over here at Malka, his name is Isaac. He showed me this HDMI out on the cameras. He said to set it at 1080p-i. He did that for me, so I'm gonna see if that works. But I have to take the unit home and mess around with it, test it, record for an hour, and just continue to switch back and forth for an hour. We'll figure it out. Anyways, everything's ready to go. Um, so I edited on the computer here. I started exporting it on my laptop so when I clean up everything and let's say it's not done by then I can still be on the way home and upload it from my house my house has new brand new high-speed internet upload speed so it'll be up in a jiffy once I get home all right see you guys there well I gotta pack all this stuff up first Oy. the most out of the bike game that you could have seen but yeah I mean, you know you're talking about a bike you're hearing a lot just got home and it is at, is that 69? So yeah, 69% exported. So you want to be a producer, huh? My apartment's a mess around because I just moved in and I don't really have much time to get everything all squared away. It's not too bad actually though. All right, time to get back to work. All right, I'm back. And I'm situated now. The show is at 72% exported. Once it's at 100%, I'm gonna upload this to our Fighter and the Kid YouTube channel. And I have luckily some brand new internet that has pretty fast upload speed. So that should be up and live by within, within an hour. I mean, less than an hour, I would say. All right, I think that's gonna be it. I'm gonna probably just chill, relax, maybe grab a little bit of a sip make some dinner and then go to sleep. And then tomorrow morning I have a photo shoot with Brendan. It's gonna be Brendan, Chappelle, Malik, Kat, and myself. And we're gonna be shooting some, some photo shoot stuff for his Thick Boy clothing line. Maybe I might take you guys with me, I don't know. But... <laughs> Quick break, make sure to subscribe. I have a bunch more of these coming out. Uh, I made it a goal of mine to start making more content. And I also bought brand new. Sony A7S III, a very expensive camera. I'm gonna try to film every week and make more content. So make sure to subscribe. I have more coming out. See you later. Maybe I might take you guys with me. I don't know, but until then, until the next episode or until the next time I see you guys on camera, good night, I think.